Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I have got a top on by the way, <laughs> you just can't really see it. Um, so in today's video, I am gonna be doing a new makeup tutorial, which is completely different to what I usually do. Yes, I'm using pink, what is going on? Um, but I've been really enjoying this makeup look at the moment. I've just been having more fun when I do my makeup and I don't know, I just like it, which is weird for me because I'm not using cappuccino on my lips. If you've been following me for a while, you'll know that that's my go-to, I don't need anything else. I'm not, <laughs> what is going on? So yeah. Yeah, I've been really really liking it at the moment. Um, I'm using two of my favourite palettes that I've ever used ever and they are always in my go-to makeup drawer. I use them every day so it's really really exciting to create such different looks with an everyday makeup palette which is really exciting. So anyway if you guys want to know how I got this makeup look, look at my highlight! Ah, where is it? Oh there it is. <laughs> then please keep watching. I'm going to use the Carly Bible palette and use this first neutral shade here just to pop on as a base. Then moving on to the iconic London palette, I'm going to use the Merlot Mondays colour with the Vanity Planet brush, just blending this into my crease until it looks like this. It took me a while, but you'll get there in the end and pop it on your lower lash line. Moving on to Beleni, which is from the same iconic London palette, I'm going to use this on my crease and blend this outwards, upwards and downwards. It's so beautiful and it blends really, really nicely. Moving back to my iconic, not iconic, the Carly Bible palette from BH. I'm going to use this beautiful pink shade and pop it all over my crease. It's so beautiful. You can use some setting spray if you want to make it a little bit more like, whoa. Um, and then what I'm going to do is move back onto the blending brush and blend all, all the edges just to make sure it's so seamless and it just blends really nicely. Then I'm going to put a tiny bit of this really light shimmery cash shade I can't talk and then this dark purple shade on the outer V of my eye just to darken the eye a little bit and then I'm going to move on to some glitter which is from BH and the pink one is from eBay it's just eye glitter and I mix them together and put a tiny amount on for liner I'm going to do a wing I use this NYX um, liquid liner and I haven't done a wing in so long so I thought you guys might want to see something a little bit different um, and then I'm going to use my L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara for my lashes. By the way, the brushes I used in today's video are from Vanity Planet. I will have a code for you guys down below, which have 70% 70, 70 off, so I love them. Then to use my lashes, I'm going to pop these ones on. I've forgotten what they're called, but I... No, I do know, they're Tatty Lashes in TL3, I think. Um, I'm obsessed, I love them. I'm just bronzing myself up a little bit with the NYX Bronzer. Um, and also this Vanity Planet brush and then I'm also going to use some blusher just to make sure my cheeks are a little bit peachy you know just to go over the makeup look because I love it for highlighter I'm going to use the iconic London illuminator drops you guys know these are my favorite I love them so 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 much so I'm just going to use my finger to blend them out it's really good to dab because it is a liquid um, so you don't want to make your makeup very patchy. And then I'm just going to mix these two highlighters with the fan brush from Vanity Planet and pop it over the top. I just like to use it to set it in place sort of thing, just because I do. And I like a glow, <laughs> so I'm just going to use them too. For lips, I'm going to use not cappuccino. Um, it's 712 lip liner from Kika. I got this ages ago. Don't know if they still do it. They should do. I'd be surprised if they didn't, but it is from Kiko. And then I'm going to use this Huda Beauty liquid lipstick in Trophy Wife. That's it, my camera was not focusing. <laughs> and then I'm just gonna use a tiny bit on my lips. You literally need the tiniest bit. Um, and then I'm gonna blend it out with my lip liner because I kind of liked this sort of soft look it had to it. I don't like liquid lipsticks that are too drying. Um, and then to finish it off, I'm gonna use some setting spray. And then I'm also just gonna bronze up my body using this Kylie Bible palette, which I love. So everyone, this is the final result. I hope you've enjoyed this makeup look and I hope it's been informative and I hope you like the fact that I've done a different makeup look. If I see a comment down below which says it looks the same, then you're lying because it doesn't. <laughs> I've been using completely different products, completely different colours and my lip combo is so different. So I don't know, I just really, really love it. I don't know why though. In so many videos, my makeup looks the same even though it's so different. So I'm not sure why, but it might be my camera, it might be me. I don't know, maybe I need different lenses. 
because like contact lenses that'd be fun but yeah if you've enjoyed it give it a thumbs up and also subscribe if you're new to my channel um i upload two videos every week but then it's maybe more so you need to click the bell button next to the subscribe because you'll get notified on when i upload every video because i'm going to do sort of extra videos during the week then there's sort of a new product that's come out like i've done one on friday with the new anastasia beverly hills highlighter just reviewing that just a quick short snappy video because i feel like i don't want to do like a proper video on it for my one day or thursday upload but i think if i just do an extra video during the week then it's fine so that's what the plan is for that i'm sorry if the lighting keep changes as well i've got all my lights here but the natural light's over there and it's like sunny cloudy can't make up its mind but anyway enough of me talking hence why i don't have voiceover in this video because all i do is talk and i film it's so frustrating especially when i have to edit every time i'm like oh my god why did i do that but anyway it's fine make sure you give it a thumbs up subscribe and click the bell button and i will see you in my next video bye